Daniel, just tell us a little bit about your afternoon and... Well, we'll be sat in house and then um, we are knocking things, we'll be fine, it's going to be fine. And then we waited till half past 11 at night to evacuate us all, we've got nowhere to go. There's no transport to anywhere. But I don't know what I'm going to do, I've got, I've got nowhere to go, I don't know. They're not providing us with any support, they're just telling us to wait here. And for what, I don't know. Ex explain what the council or the people in charge have said to you. Wait for transport to a leisure centre, which will be stood outside here for 45 uh, minutes and we've still got no information on where to go. And when we were talking about the building, it's previously it was um, covered in cladding, I believe. I believe so, yeah, I'm not interested on that. But um, they said it was a structural issue at what, four or five o'clock? They've knocked on the doors and told us it's going to be all right. And then they've come up last minute at half 12, half 11 and told us we've got to leave. Now everyone's got nowhere to go. There's kids out here, there's people who are disabled, like with nowhere to go. It's ridiculous. And the council should be ashamed. Barristan.